Yeah, some days I feel unfazed Like when I'm with my friends with a cup raise And I go right back at it like an automatic More drinks, more songs, more beats to rap A new era, wet my P's and O's I'm stocking up on the loose If the lyrics come easy, but the life is a doozy And yes, I'm choosy, and no, I won't settle But I still take pop off over that kettle Cause I'm talking bigger picture And yes, I'm gonna hit you with the... Nerevar, you got your costume ready? Okay, good. I still can't believe you're going as a filthy Argonian, but it's your costume, not mine. We're gonna meet the guys at Denny's first, and then we'll head to the corn maze. At least that's what we all agreed on. Who knows if any crazy BS happens before all that. I'll be ready in a second, just gotta use some mouthwash. <coughs> You know, would have it killed you to dress up for Halloween, Mirak? I mean, who are you even supposed to be? I'm going as myself. Got a problem with that? Dude, we all got dressed up, and you're the only one that isn't in a costume. I just don't see the point. It causes more problems than it solves for me. Anyways, where the hell is Dagoth and Nerevar? They should have been here like ten minutes ago. They texted me they were stuck in traffic. They should be here any minute now. What's popping, bitches? Speak of the devil. God damn, you really went all out on that, didn't you? I was saving it for a rainy day of world domination, but sadly that day never came. It was either this or go as a clown. And I fucking hate clowns. Yeah, Nerevar brought up a good point. Where's Maya and Shax? Over here, you nearsighted robot. Holy shit, you look hot as hell. You like it, babe? After this corn maze, you're definitely getting a ride on my corn on the cob if you catch my drift. Jesus Christ! Jesus, dude. We didn't need to know that. We didn't need to know what? Oh, thank the Lord. Shacks for the love of God changed the subject. So, are we ready for this corn maze, gentlemen? And madam? Yeah, absolutely. Me and Nerevar are ready. We could probably carpool three of you with us. What about everyone else? Y'all can ride with me. All right. I guess we'll meet each other over there. Okay, bet. You know, maybe it's just me, but I think Mirak and Maya are kind of being a bit too open about their relationship. What do you mean? I mean, like, just before you walked in, he was going on about how he was going to rail her after this maze. Like, why the hell do we need to know that? Oh, good lord. You're being hella dramatic, Dagoth. I think it's kind of romantical myself. You think that's romantical? No wonder the last dragon you dated dumped you. Hey, fuck you! Last time I checked, at least I didn't become a bitter bitch over her like you did with Azura. I... fair point, Alduin. Fair fucking point. Uh, I wonder how the rest of them are doing. Chief, does this thing have a radio? Yeah, but it's broken and I can't get the CD out of it. Seriously? You don't got anything to fill this silence? Look, the only options we got are to hear nothing, or hear the Barbie theme song on repeat. Play the music. Alright, looks like we're here. Should we wait for the other guys, or should we get started? Does it really matter? It's a one-mile maze each way, so no one's finishing instantly. Yeah, fair point. We can hopefully meet them in the maze when they get here. You sure this is the right place? It's what Apple Maps said was the location. No, I get that, but I mean, like, where is everyone? We're probably the first ones here. I want to bet they got stuck behind some dumbass driver or something. Either way, we'll get started and hopefully we can meet them in the maze. Just saying, whoever made this maze did a shitty ass job. What was that? Probably just a little kid or something. Wait guys, here's an opening. It looks freshly made. Chief, is that you? No, I'm over here. Then who the hell is breathing down my neck? Get the fuck out Go, go, go! Run. Get up and run, Mirak! Why couldn't you have used Google Maps? Shut up and run. We're about to get our asses ripped open. Ooh, sounds kinky. Shut up! Shut up! Dead end ahead! We're cornered! We're gonna die! No, we're not! Taste Glock 19, motherfucker! Wait, since when do you carry a gun on you? 
My motto's always been stay strapped or get clapped. Helps for stuff like this. Let's see who was under this mask. Wow, oh, what the fuck? You break into my fun, interrupt me from my grandchildren's Halloween party, and then you shoot me? This isn't a corn maze? No! We thought you were hunting us down to kill us or something. I called the cops already on you psychos for burglary. Plus with the blood on the tires, I think you might have killed someone else. Wait, there's blood on the tires? There is. <laughs> what was that? Uh, nothing. Just a speed bump. I was wondering why that bump felt a little squishy. Y'all are so screwed once the police show up. Sir, can't we work something out? We'll pay you for your injuries and also throw in 20,000. You got that much money? Shh, I'm bluffing. So, sir, do we got a deal? You have got to have the worst charisma in the history of mankind. Well, at least I tried to do something apart from running like your big-ass midday stroller of a body. Besides, we can call Shax and all of them to bail us out. Uh, yeah. About that, that might not work out like you thought it would. How the hell did you guys end up in here? We could ask you the same thing. Let's see. We ran someone over, got lost, and broke into someone's farm and shot the owner who was confronting us. What about you guys? It's really not much worse than what you guys did. Well, it started shortly after we got there. We got tired of waiting for you guys, so we went ahead and started. We stayed as a group so we wouldn't get lost. But sure enough, even as a group we got lost in there, so I had the grand idea to cheat a little. What did he do? He burned down the entire fucking maze! Why do you always have to burn everything, you dumbass? I genuinely don't know. After that, we heard police cars and we decided to leave immediately. Except they knew exactly who lit the fire and chased us down the interstate. Oh good god, oh Jesus, we're so fucked! Shut up and floor it! We eventually ran out of gas and got arrested. Then the rest is history. So, what now? I got one more idea. They never took my cell phone, so I can make one phone call to fix all of this. Hang on. Hello, this is the most awesome president speaking. Who am I speaking with? Dagoth. It's been a hot minute. How's everyone doing? Wait, slow down. What happened? You guys did what? Oh, good lord. All right, get comfortable. I'm heading over there immediately. Trump, get a few pardon forms ready. I'm going to need like seven of them, pronto. Like hell, I'm going to do any of that. You want shit done? Start paying me more then, fucking cheap bastard. I swear to Christ, I will dragon shout whoever's farting like that to oblivion if they keep doing that. Sorry, I had too many beans for dinner last night. All right, you've all been pardoned. You're free to go. And whoever's been farting in here, please, for the love of God, lay off the beans. Thank you so much, Ben. How were you able to get us out so fast? Did you forget him, a politics guy? I know, people. Well, since that fiasco's over with, what now? Want to head home and ride on my corn on the cob? Oh, heck yeah, I do. Shut up! For God's sake, shut up! Shut the fuck up! <laughs> Subscribe for more videos in the future, or don't, I don't really care, I get paid to read this script regardless.